Oh my god, I'm gonna shave my face. Hey guys, welcome back. So today I'm good gonna be shaving my face for the first time. Um I don't know how this is gonna go. When I do videos like this, I'm not doing it as a tutorial because I'm not an expert. I'm just doing a thing where you know you're just sharing with you guys and the reason why I'm shaving my face is because I'm gonna be getting a laser on my face now, so I can't wax anymore, even on my brows. I mean I can under here, but the top bit will probably be lasered, so I'm just gonna shave it everything. And to be honest, like I've got too much hair here. Um it can't have been for the wax because I've been waxing my face for a while. Even here, like it's just getting overboard, like overboard thick. My brows have been getting thicker, hair here has been getting thicker, and I really feel like it's my rosehip oil from The Ordinary, like I love that oil, but I feel like that's been making my hair grow like crazy. It could be only that, I haven't changed anything else. But anyways, that's just a bit of background on why I'm shaving my face, and Huda Beauty does it, so might as well do it myself. So the thing that I've been I'll be using is this thing that I got from uh, eBay. This one has really small blades and bigger ones. This is what it looks like. I'll try and link it in the info box if I can. This is going to be a super casual video, by the way, guys. I'm first going to take a big one. Looks like I'm going to take a knife out or something. Should we use a white one? Let's use a white one. So they come with a lid. And this is what it looks like. Okay, shall we just go into doing it? Let me show you before though. Can you guys see my face? My hairy ass face? And look at my moustache. I waxed that not long ago and it's just full on there. It's everywhere here. Also get some on my forehead. So let's, shall we just do this? Let me do this side first. <gasps> That's so sharp. I didn't put anything on my face. Ew! This is literally taking all my peach fuzz off. <gasps> I feel like my face is going to be so spiky afterwards. So this is like shaving that you do without anything, you do it dry. That, look at that, crazy, this is all coming off. I don't know if you can see the peach fuzz. It also helps to shape my brows. And now I need to show you up close. Look at that. This is actually so fun. This is my most hairiest part of my face. That's a bit of close-up action, but here I need to pull my skin out. This is so satisfying. I also hate my hairline. I need to stop putting eyeshadow in it. Do you know what? Let's use the little one. That's so convenient. Should we try it underneath? So I don't cut myself. A good job. I can't wait to put my makeup on tomorrow. I'm trying to do it rough on my sideburns because I don't want that to be like looking. Like I've like tried to take it off, you know. I'm gonna use some of my Glow Booster Serum from Glow Girl Cosmetics. 
and just apply this i'm not going to use anything like oily on my skin this is very like watery like got vitamin c and the hyaluronic acid and then I'm going to use some of my Bobbi Brown gel cream, which is water-based. I have this sometimes when I just want to give my, my skin a break. I'm going to check in sometime tomorrow and show you guys if I have reacted or getting, gotten any spots from doing this on my skin. Obviously, the hair's probably going to grow out spikier, but I'll keep you guys updated on that. But so far, my skin feels hella soft, like... I just want to buff foundation on this right now. It does sting a little bit in some areas. But the real question is, am I going to get spots everywhere? That's the real question. Or if I'm going to get irritated. <sighs> so yeah, so far I'm really, really, really happy with it. I'm so tired today. It's been a very long day look like a bruja bruja so yeah i'm gonna head off i'm gonna go to bed and yeah i'm gonna by the time i wash my face tomorrow evening i'll check in with you guys and see how my skin is really hopefully i don't get anything but that's the whole point of this video hey guys so it's now the next day and i thought i'll quickly check in with you guys um so i'm actually really digging this like shaved face thing because my makeup looks so the softest I've ever seen it. I'm gonna show you guys a close up, but my makeup glided on like a dream. So, and I haven't broken out. I mean, I've got some, I've got a spot there, which is not that really a spot. And I've got one here, which is irrelevant, but it's not like my skin has gone bumpy or like really rough. Like my skin is quite good. So I'm really happy with the results. That's just a quick close up for you guys looks absolutely smooth so I'm gonna just wear this makeup till the end of the day and when I've washed my face I'll quickly check in with you guys and end the video hey guys so I just wanted to end the video here because I just can't bother to get my lamp and my back camera stand and everything out so I'm just gonna do it casually like this it's now around like 9 30 p.m. I think it's been well over 24 hours and my skin is doing well I mean there is a slight texture to it, but I feel like after a few days that would die down. But you can't really see it unless you feel it. All just spots I had before. But I'm really happy with the way my makeup went on and I'm just really excited to get laser because I feel like my skin looks much better without all the hair. I didn't mind it before, but it was getting a lot, it was getting, it was growing a lot lately. So I thought, let me take it all off. And yeah so i just wanted to share this experience with you guys i hope you enjoyed it give it a big thumbs up and subscribe i love you guys and i'll see you